The term penny stocks is used to describe shares of small companies, a humorous name chosen due to the low price such shares usually trade at. They're also called micro caps if the company has a market capitalization between 50 and $300 million, or nano caps if the company has a market capitalization of less than 50 million. Should you invest in such stocks? Well, probably not. The main problems penny stocks have are one, they're not very liquid. You can sell shares of companies such as Apple or Google instantly since there's a huge market for them, whereas penny stocks are for the most part thinly traded and you might not be able to find buyers at all in some situations. Two, they're usually not listed on the major exchanges such as the New York Stock Exchange, but rather on so-called over-the-counter exchanges such as the OTC Bulletin Board, where the requirements such as accounting standards that need to be met are considerably lower. As such, penny stocks are definitely far less transparent than regular stocks, and the information you obtain about them should be considered less trustworthy. Three, they're perhaps the most fraud-filled financial sector, with lots of unscrupulous brokers engaging in pump-and-dump schemes through which they make share prices go up by spreading false rumors, then sell their shares and let prices drop. Investing in penny stocks is kind of like being a fish surrounded by sharks or a sheep surrounded by wolves. It probably won't end well for you, and as such, staying away is usually the smart thing to do.